In this video, we will review the possibilities of Code Editor in Mobirize. Add the Code Editor extension, which is available for separate purchase or as part of the Mobirize kit. If you have a Mobirize kit subscription, you already have access to it. Simply locate it in the extensions list. After adding Code Editor, open your project. As you can see, there is the Edit Code button available for all blocks in the app. Let's click on it. You can see two sections, HTML Editor and CSS Editor. The existing code here is the code of our block. In HTML Editor, there is a structure of the blocks. In CSS Editor, there are style rules applied to it. Let's make a quick change. I want to add a shadow to the image. So I write the shadow effect for the IMG tag on hover. Also, I add the transition rule for the IMG tag itself for a smooth fade. Let's save our changes and check how it works now. Now let's edit something in HTML editor. I will change the code so we will have two images in this block. Let's locate our image in the code. Here it is. I duplicate this code so we'll have a copy. We need to change the width of our images. In this code, we should change the column width with bootstrap classes. The bootstrap framework is used for most available Mobirize themes. You can use the bootstrap documentation to work with the code more effectively. Let's preview it. We can see two images with shadow effects on hover. Our changes work. But what if I want to change something for the whole page? Let's add the same effect for all images of our page. For adding this effect, let's open Style Editor. If Code Editor is installed, you should see the Edit in Code Editor button. When we click on it, we see the CSS editor for the whole site. I will add our style rule for a shadow to static styles. And here is the result. It works. Let's go back and look at this editor again. In Site Parameters, you can see the settings used in Style Editor. In dynamic styles, there are styles that are written for the variables set in site parameters. We won't stop at this topic in this review. Let's explore more features the code editor has. What else? You can add your code globally for the whole page. Let's open page settings. You can see special fields in page settings if code editor is installed. You can add something inside the head tag in the end of body or before the whole code of your page. In our example, we'll decorate our titles on the page. I add the style tag here and our rule for headings, text, transform, uppercase. Let's see how it works in the browser. And now, let's try to change something for the whole site. It's better to add styles via style changer. But if you want to add some scripts, you can use the global HTML insert feature. Find it in site settings. I'll add the analytics script here.
let's check the code of the published site. Good luck with your coding experiments.